persönliche Riesenfreude, Boys Sets Fire bei mir begrüßen zu dürfen. Rob, Nathan und Matt. Pleasure to have you here, guys. Thank you. Thanks so, a lot. I think it's the first Pleasure time that you're in yeah. German music television. So oh, yeah, on television. Just, yeah. just, yeah. A, just a few words about um, Boys Sets Fire, the band. How long are you existing now? Uh, uh, seven years? Seven, seven years? Seven, seven, seven years. years, yep. Now in the last last couple, last couple of months or year, you got some um, record company. I don't know problems, but mm -hmm. what, what happened? Um, I wouldn't quite call it problems. It's just that we uh, we had a one-off with them. We were ready to go to the, uh, the next level. We wanted to play to more people. We wanted to get our music out to as many people as possible, and and uh, we don't like bulldogs. <laughs> Nathan, I'm scared of them. <laughs> Well, they bite. They bite. No, actually, bulldog. I said bulldog because we were on Victory Records, uh, and we just needed to get out to a wider audience because we feel that we have a lot to say, we have a lot to communicate, and we want to tell people how we feel. And by doing festivals like this, and by playing with your heroes like Sick of It All and fucking uh, Avail, and it's it's an awesome time. It's lots of fun, and and you know, we need. We needed to take that next step, and part of taking the next step was going to this record label and, you know, doing what we had to do. What is the record label called? I just know, I always say, okay, oh, they... Wind Up. Wind Up. Wind Up Records. Wind Up, okay. That's... They're an independent label out of uh, New York City. They've been... Oh, is it right that it's owned by Creed? It's not owned, not by, owned Creed. by Creed. Okay, no. that's, they're oh, on the label. Boys, it's fire. They went to the. Well, they signed to the label for the first, I'll clear up the rumors. There's three rumors circulating. One, they're not a major label. Mm -hmm. They're 100 independent. Uh, two, they're not owned by Creed at all. Okay. Creed is on the label, but okay. not owned by Creed. Okay. And three, we did not change our name to Boy Hits Car, <laughs> which a lot of people uh, have uh, thought we did. So. Yeah, I always say. Was it Boy Hits Car? No, that's Boy Hits Fire. No, that's something totally, come totally, totally different. different. Totally different. Totally different. Auf jeden Fall. Different name, different music, just the same label. And I might say different attitude. I don't know Boy Hits Car, but whatever. Um, is this your first time that you're here in Germany? Um, actually, this is our... I don't know. Third ask door. this guy. What? Third, Third door. door. I'm near the bank. Third door. So ask this dude. Uh -huh. Third door. Um, How is it now if you if you play in, in German clubs? So do, do the people sing along with your songs? Do they have you recognized that they know yeah. it? Yeah. Yeah, cool. Okay. <laughs> I don't know how to Yeah, that's what I ask I don't know how to expound on that. It's just like Yes. Yes, yes, that's what I want to do. <laughs> yes, they do. But now the question. Okay. How do you feel when you recognize this? Oh, I love it. I mean it's like when you go, you know, over to Europe and people are singing along and feeling the same emotions and and stuff that we felt when we wrote the music it uh it gives us a boost it makes us feel good it makes us uh feel that someone's paying attention you know so all right so um you you said that you wanted to spread out to more um to a wider audience mm -hmm. so are there plans for for video shoot or something like that doing videos um, would like to so, yeah, I mean, you know, we don't have any plans right now for it, but sure, we'd do it, you know? All right. We don't really set any limits on, you know, how far we want to go. We just sort of go. Mm -hmm. so. We're in the middle, you know, aside from doing this tour, uh, we're kind of in the middle of the writing process right now. So when we, once we get home in mid-June, we'll continue with the writing process, start doing pre-production, getting the studio, getting the producer, so on and so forth. Once the album's done, mixed and mastered, then we'll be able to sit down and really thoroughly look at what we've been able to do within the last year and a half, pick out a song that we feel would be the strongest, bring it to radio. If it does well on radio, then hopefully uh, we'll mutually agree with the label to go ahead and S do a video. S signing to Wine Up um, Records, do you have to compromise? Not at all. Nope. We've got 100% creative control. Uh, the distribution's there, the ideas, the budgeting, the marketing plans, oh, everything's there, everything's solid. Uh, the, the terms of the deal are, are very positive for us. I think uh, something's cell phone's going on. Yeah, yeah, it's mine. It's very professional. Your ass is singing. <laughs> My ass is singing. So, we, don't, we don't feel that we're in a situation. Ah. 
Nice. <laughs> Sorry, I'm on TV. Um, okay, good luck for that and hope to see you again next year. Oh, what? Well, uh, where you play this year? Where are you going to play this year? We're doing Cologne obviously today. We do Munich at the end of the deconstruction Where's tour. Zurich? That's in Switzerland. Switzerland, two Italy shows. Austria and another German show in Munich. In Munich. Yep. And and after Zexa, these Zexa. Dates, we have some more shows in Germany. In, in autumn? Yeah. Yeah. Well, actually, at the end of this deconstruction tour, there's uh, Czech Republic, and then I believe we have oh, yeah. uh, Got about that. seven or eight more German shows. Okay. With the Veil so. and Sick of It All. Well, some of them are with Sick of It All. All of them were with a veil, and then with the exception of like four shows at the end, which is just us. Okay, that's good. So, did you already say that? Kind of swore. Okay, okay, cool, sorry. <laughs> so, <laughs> so hope that we have the chance one day to, to do a whole one hour show at Truak. That'd be really great. Be awesome. A whole hour? Thank, Thank you very much. A whole hour? A whole awesome. hour? Thank you. I'd awesome. like to do that's that. nice meeting you. Thanks a lot. Boys, that's why I live. Wow. Woo! Yeah! <laughs> <laughs>